Delta State Government is taking steps in tackling the perennial flooding ravaging some parts of the state. The State Governor Ifanyo Kowa says though it is a long-term project, but he is committed uh, to making remarkable progress before the end of his tenure. TVC News' Ikan Namichi has more. Wari is a general term used to define the areas that span from Efron, an Uwe local government area, to Wari Southwest and Wari South Council areas. It is called Oya City because it used to play host to many oil companies, but not anymore. Over the years, its infrastructure has decayed due to neglect. Roads are deplorable and drainage system completely non-existent or blocked, turned to dump site or having building erected over them where they exist. All these have led to flooding in the areas. In a bid to return the city to its lost glory and reposition it for investment, the Delta State Governor inaugurated several committees to address these issues and attract development to the area. Today, the Committee on Tackling Flood in the Oya City is here at the Government House to present its findings to the state government. The Committee's detailed presentation elaborated the causes and the solutions to the perennial flooding. It also prioritized some areas to handle, which the state government says will be given attention soon, but wants stakeholders to be involved in the process to ensure smooth execution of the project. It's a desire. It's a desire to open up the creeks. It's a desire to uh, ensure that um, we are able to uh, reduce the level of flooding in the Wari, Efuran, and its environs, just as we're doing in Asaba. And that, um, uh, by the grace of God, uh, the efforts that we're putting in the next few years. Uh, will make a great impact. We pray for the cooperation of every Deltan. Uh, we need their partnership in this. We will also at some point in time ask for partnership uh, from both the federal government and also from NDDC. Just like the storm drainage system in the state capital, the worry and its environment drainage system suffered dilapidation due to human activities and it will take political will of those in authority to correct this menace plaguing worry. Ikenna Amechi, TVC News, Asaba.